Good play from Tomari. Foden wants it. Foden gets it. It's Phil Foden. Oh! <laughs> Hello, everyone. Devani here, and welcome back to my channel. We are back with some more FIFA 22. Phil Foden, mind player, okay, real mode. We're on to episode four now, season two. And what a start to the season we had so far with Phil Foden. We've played 18 games in our competitions, 12 goals, and nine assists. Playing that camp position for AC Milan. Not a bad place to play. Watson went ahead and got a player of the month for October, which is a nice. Um, a war to add to our collections there, but we have a chance now to try and extend our lead in the Serie A. Milan are lying thir what 31 points, lying first, which is one point above Napoli in second, and what six points above Bergamo Casio, which I just found out was a it's Atalanta, so we will be playing them in this episode. Should be a good game, and we also have a chance to wrap up the Champions League group stage. We should be finishing top of the group in that one. So I'm looking forward to it. If you're just now checking out the channel, please subscribe down below, smash a like on this video, and first of all, a massive thank you to everyone who's been watching this series so far, and let's get this episode rolling. All right, so let's take a look at the calendar here. We have Atalanta coming up, which we'll definitely play. They're a good team. Um, I'm assuming this match, and then we have Monaco, which I might play, but we're already topping the group. And then the Sampdoria, and then the Milan derby against Inter Milan. That's the one I'm looking forward to um, for this episode. And then there's a few games we could also play here in my sim as well. So we'll see. We'll see how it all goes. But especially, I'm looking forward to this Atalanta game. They're these. Look at this team. They're playing a 3-4-2-1. Zapata up there. Corona, Pessina, Ilicic. Ataboa, Copa Miners, Gosens, um, them City, Archebi, Romero, Golini. That's a damn good team. That's a damn good team. So it's going to be a good match. We're playing at the San Siro. Ultimate difficulty. And let's see how we do against Atalanta. It's first against third. <laughs> it's a big one when Milan takes on Atalanta, the team that Atalanta has built this season. They're a decent side. The line third in the Serie A. So it's definitely going to be a good match. If if they win against Milan, they're closing that gap. And Napoli wins, Napoli goes on top of the table. So it's going to be a, it's a crucial game for Milan. They have to at least try to get a win in this game. Let's take a look at our match objectives. They get a match, win if at least 8.5, get an assist, and get a team possession rate of at least 60%. I don't know about the possession, but we can try and get at least an assist and an 8.5 match rating. Shouldn't be too difficult. Let's go ahead and get this, this game going. We're playing at the camp position in the first half. It's underway. Now it's Salamakas who looks to be back after that injury. Phil Foden. It's Foden. Oh, what a save. <laughs> what a save there. What a shot from Phil Foden. And what a save. It's out for a corner kick. It's going to go crossing. The lovely delivery from Foden. Off the post. Off the post. Foden. Lovely cross back pose. Oh. Good play here from AC Milan. Nice with Anton Rebek. Still Rebek. Foden wants it. Foden gets it. Richarlison. What a shot. It's a good save. Oh, it's off for a corner kick. Milan are playing some tremendous stuff here. Cross comes in. Foden. Oh. Now it's with Dem City. Goes out wide to Ilicic. Pessina. Good play here from both sides. It's with Pessina. Finds Christian Zapata, goes to Jesus Corona, it's with Copa Miners. Good shot, good save there. My co-keeper, Mark Minion. It's out for a corner kick here to Atalanta. Cross comes in, Zapata, oh my goodness. Good save off the post. And it's out for a corner kick. Another corner kick here for Atalanta. They are approaching here. It's a good corner kick. Whacked away. Moving good interception. Oh, giving away is Gosens. Good strike and good save. What a save by Mark Minion. Atalanta, please and team, you know. What a game this is. <laughs> it's a corner kick. Cross comes in. Headed away. One out of minute to this first half. Given away cheaply by the goalkeeper. Oh, Phil and Salamakas are getting each other away there, man. Come on, boys. Nil nil at the halftime whistle. But this game could have been three, four, three, three or four, three in this game. Because both teams are really going for it here. Just it's good goalkeeping from both sides. And nobody would have really clear cut chance so far to try and take the lead. But so far we have an 8.4 rating, almost at the 8.5. Possession exactly not we can't get 60%, but look, we still need that assist. We still need that assist to Rich Allison. The form he's on. If we can get assist to Rich Allison this season, we'll be in we'll be in good form. Let's go and get a second half going here and see if we can turn this draw into a win, which will be a massive, massive win for Milan. And the second half is underway. Good touch from Coop Miners. Still with Coop Miners. Goes out wide to Corona. What a save by Mark Minion! 
What a save from Christian Zapata. Oh my goodness, that's close range. Atalanta should be up 2 or 3 0 in this game as well. It could be anybody's game, but brilliant goalkeeping. It's still at 0 0. Headed away. Now nah, that's where Jim City. Here's a shake. We're passing here from Atalanta so far. Lovely passing and movement. Lovely true pass. It's Jesus Corona. Good save again. Oh my goodness. The goalkeepers cannot be beaten today. No matter what happens, they cannot be beaten. Oh, Rebek makes way for Rafael Liao. I like that substitution. I like it. I like only more pace up there. Corner kick comes in. Good headed away. Uh, that's got to be a foul. Good tackling. Good tackling. Good play here from Tonali. It's with Phil Foden. Goes out wide to Alexis Salamakas. Now it's Foden. Come on, boys. Back into life here. Good play. There we go, Conti. Conti. Phil Foden. Oh, Bakayoko. Tomari. Bakayoko. Jimmy Vardy. Phil Foden. Jimmy Vardy. Get in there. That's in contact. He assists, but look. Milan has been problem here. They've piled under pressure in the last five minutes or so. And they deserve this goal here. Lovely strike from Jamie Vardy. He comes in for Rich Alex and he gets the goal. Foden a little bit unlucky there. Lovely passing and moving around the bars. Jamie Vardy. Foden should have shot it. Tries to cut back in on his on his stronger foot there. Good tackle and it falls to Jamie Vardy. And finally, the goalkeepers have been beaten in this game. From close range this time, Jamie Vardy makes no mistake. And he pulls AC Milan up here. 1-0 in this game. Get in there, boys. Let's go. One added minute to this game. They don't like Atalanta. This should have at least three minutes for them. Oh, no. It's with Jesus Corona. Goes out wide to Pessina. Get it out. Good defending. Get it out, Bakayoko. What are you doing? There goes the four-time whistle. And it ends 1-0 here for Milan with a goal from Jamie Vardy. Get in there. Get in there. That's all that's needed. Atalanta are a good team. They gave us one hell of a game. They could have won this game 4-0. We could have won it 3-0. It could have been 4-3, 5-4. But it ends 1-0 because the goalkeepers are on steroids in the game. Absolutely brilliant goalkeeping from both goalkeepers here. And it only ends 1-0. Not a good performance from Foden. No goals or assists. He had two shots on target. But look, his team got the win. And that's the most important thing for him here. Ugh, we move on. We move on, boys. We're only, we're only tapping the table by one point. So we need every win we can get. And that will be a damaging win here for Atalanta. Because they're, a ter they're a third in the table and neither this win. But Milan proved to be the much better for Salarintana. <laughs> right, let's do a quick sim. I'm not even going to change the kits because I don't really bother about it. If you skip it, imagine yeah, that's fine. That's fine. we got to win this game anyway. What? What? 2-1 loss for Milan against this team that I don't even know what their name is. Salarintana. 2-1. You've got to be kidding me, man. You've got to be kidding. Kidding. We have Monaco coming up. Uh, we already clinched the group stage as well. I just realized we have 15 points. So even if we lose this match, we still clinch the group stage. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and sim this. I'm going to do another quick sim here. Why not? How are we losing these games with quick sim? We should be winning. 3 0 loss. Are you having a laugh? 3 0 loss. That's back to back losses. Uh, we're not on a good run. We're not on a good run. And there you have it. Napoli half taken over. And look at this cheese. Look at this cheese. <laughs> the play of the year has been announced in the fourth of PSG's Mbappe. We just won the treble with Manchester City in the last season. And they gave it to this fraud. You've got to be kidding me. He's 94, but still 99 sprint speed, 99 acceleration. <laughs> 96 agility but come on Foden was the better player okay he, we won the Champions League we won the treble okay we won the higher goal scorers but we won the treble Tonali is out for two months what is going on we're lacking now um, we're two points below two points below Timo Puki is on our team Puki, Nino, Silva, Damsgaard, Kandreva I mean not a bad team not a bad team actually Jamie Vardy starts because Richarlison has been, hasn't been firing lately. Everyone is playing pretty poor. Adley now comes in because our guy, Maldini. I mean, not Maldini, but Tonali is injured. I think I'll do a quick sim. There we go. 2-1 victory. Foden with a goal. Rebek with a goal. We'll do a quick sim. I know exactly what I did. Now. We'll do a quick sim. That's fine. We should be winning this game against Sam Doria anyway. We'll take it. We'll take it. 
have an Inter Milan coming up. They're lying seventh in the Serie A. It's going to be a massive game. The Milan Derby is what we've been looking forward to. They're playing 3 1 4 2. Martinez and Edin Dzeko up there. Barella, Chananolu. Chananolu comes against his former team. And Ericsson, Christian Ericsson, Barella, Green, Mason Greenwood. Mason Greenwood is on Inter Milan. Screenia. Oh my goodness. Hadanovic, that's going to be a good game. I'm looking forward to it. Mason Greenwood versus Phil Foden in the Serie A. Let's go. That will be the title of the video. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Foden versus Greenwood in the Milan Derby. Milan on top of the league, Inter Milan line seven. They're struggling a little bit, but look, this is at the San Siro. You know, I think don't don't both teams share the same stadium, or, 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 or does that not happen anymore? I think they, they, I think they still do. I'm not even sure. But let's take a look at our match objectives here. Let's get a match win if at least eight point five, complete seven passes, and avoid losing the match. So a draw or win should be good enough for us. But look, we need to get a one. We need to get one about Greenwood. Okay, it's Greenwood. It's two generational talents going at it today. Who is going to come up on top? I'm looking forward to this game. And the first half is underway. Lovely pass to Richarlison. Salamakos wants it. Salamakos gets it. Foden is providing the option. Finds Phil Foden. Still Phil Foden. Still Phil Foden. Lovely true pass. And what a goal by Anton Rebic. Phil Foden, the provider again. Oh, that true pass to Anton Rebic is exquisite. It's laid on a silver platter here. And all Rebic had to do was just eat. He just had to deliver that. And that's a lovely goal there from Anton Rebic. The true pass, though. Take nothing away from him. Look at Foden. He comes in on the on the left-hand side. Giving time. Look at this pass. Dink. Oh, my goodness. Right between the two. Greenwood is involved as well. Mason Greenwood. Right between him and um Barella. And it's in the back of the net from Rebic. Getting nice. 1-0 to Milan in the derby. Can Inter Milan try and turn this game around? For Inter Milan, can they get back into this game? Right on the stroke of hard time. Cross comes in. Good save there from Mike Minion. Oh my goodness, this guy is a damn good goalkeeper. My goalkeeper. Unstoppable. You shall not pass. Oh, another brilliant save. Another brilliant save there from him. Oh, good play. Come on. Fallen. Oh no. Fallen. Fallen. Mason Greenwood is chasing Phil Fallen. Foden with a ding! Oh! Phil Foden gets in there. Oh, he's flying. I mean, your back should hurt from that. Right on the stroke of halftime, Milan, Inter Milan could have tied it 1 1. Foden takes it all on his own there and made it 2 1 for AC Milan. Hadanovic tries to come in a dink. That ding from Phil Foden. He knows exactly what he wanted to do with that. Hadanovic tried to come and make the goal small, but he knows exactly why he wants to hit this. Oh, Foden, you bastard. You cheeky, cheeky bastard. Get in there, boy. 2-0 for Milan. Right on the stroke of halftime. Well, in AC Milan, not Inter Milan. AC Milan. <laughs> what a performance. A goal and an assist from Phil Foden. He's been, he's been lacking in a couple of games, but he's back. He's back at his best, isn't he? He likes the big games, doesn't he? He likes the big games. 10.0 ratings already. He's completed nine passes, and we're winning. We're going to complete all our three attacks in this game. We should be. But, you know, it's still anything to play for. 45 minutes to play. Inter Milan can come back into this game. Napoli are beating Empoli. Pretty easy. The Semdoria are tied with Cagliari. Romano also tied. Roma, Roma should be doing a lot better. They should be doing a lot better. But let's go and get a second half going. 2-0 so far for AC Milan. Can they hang on to this win? The block. Foden, get up. Get up. Get up. Don't get stepped on there, Foden. Oh, Jens Haig is not really doing so well. Oh, come on. Good job there from Tonali. Giving away cheaply. Martinez. This should be the goal. And it is a goal for Inter Milan. They get one back. They're right back into this. Another goal. And it's all tied up here. Lateral Martinez. Gets a little bit of luck. The deflection falls right back to him. And he's lost that pass. Mark Minion finally. Terrible defending here from Bakayoko. What is he playing now? That's just Tomari. Good block there. But then it just falls right back into his laps. And of course, he's going to tap that in there. Oh, easy, easy goal there for Lateral Martinez. And it's now 2-1. Game on. Oh, I tell you what, the pressure is on. Come on, let's go finish this game. Foden. It's three against two. Three against two. Phil Foden. Lovely true pass to Jamie Vardy. Get in there. That should be game over. Jamie Vardy, he's flying. He's flying. 
And it comes from Phil Foden with an assist again this time. Lovely true pass. He timed that pass to extreme measures here. Look at this true pass. Jamie Vardy with an excellent run. The pass comes in and you know he's not going to miss that one. You know he's not going to miss that one. Jamie Vardy with a goal from the bench again. Richarlison, you have a competition this season. You have a competition. It's 3-1 here for AC Milan. What a win this would be. Jamie Vardy. Go, go play. Go play. Go play here for Milan. Keep it going. Let's go, Gaia. It's three against three. Four against four. Gaia. Foden. There it is. Game over. 4-1 for Milan. And that should be it. Two goals for Foden. Four, four, two assists. Oh, one assist for him. One, two goals and one assist. Oh, he's doing the name. <laughs> oh, get in there, boys. Lovely performance from Phil Foden in what is a massive win in the derby. Inter Milan has been put to the sword. Look at his counterattack. It was four against four here. He sees four in post. But what is Hardanovic doing? What is Hardanovic doing? Why would you run out your goal like that? Oh, it's an easy cutback. And of course, it's an easy tap in there for Phil Foden. He knows exactly what to be in around that game, that game position there. Simon Kia makes way. And that should be the game for AC Milan. 4-1. It should end. Two added minutes to this first world to the game. And there goes the full-time whistle. It's, it ends here 4-1 for AC Milan. And Inter Milan just didn't have enough for them. They, they, they try to come back into the game. We can understand. It was 2-1. They try to push push bodies forward. Got hit on the break. Try and go for it even more to get back in the game. And it just got, it just got hit on the break again. It was finished. Phil Ford and their excellent performance. Men of the match for me. Two assists. What? Two goals and an assist in this game. And he's been tremendous. He's been tremendous. Actually, two goals and two assists. It was two assists, wasn't it? Wow, what a performance. What a performance. That deserved 10.0. Or more. Or more. <laughs> Excellent performance here from Phil Foden. Inter Milan were a good team, but... You know, I always knew we had it. I always knew we had it. Adonavis trying to keep them in it, but that, that's about it. And Roma won 3-2. Sampdoria won, and of course, Napoli won. We clinch all of our match objectives. Get in there. So we'll sim this game against... We'll sim this game against Udinese. I mean, not a bad team... Dela Feu is on there, Molina, I mean Wallace, Pereira, I don't know, I don't know, we're just going to do a quick thing, we'll do a quick thing, hope we win, yeah, 3-0 victory here for AC Milan, Rebek with a two goals, and Gaia with a goal, get in there, I'll take that, I'll take that, but we have Bologna coming, oh, we're not, we're not in the starting lineup, we're not in the starting lineup, boys, we gotta do our trainings, we gotta do our trainings, go ahead and sim that as well, so seventh in the Serie A, so we'll definitely play this game against Bologna, um, still 43 points each. I don't really like that. I don't like that. Let's go and get this game going against Bologna. They have Anatovic, Mice. He's a good striker, Anatovic. Anatovic, or ceiling or Solini, I should say. And Sanson. Not a bad team. Not a bad team. Hoping for a good performance. They're seventh in the Serie A. So hopefully they can give us a good challenge. And we'll go ahead and get this one going here against Bologna. Wait, what? Foden is the top scorer for the Serie A? When did that happen? When did that happen? Look, we, we, we mean business. We lost the Ballon d'Or. The Ballon d'Or to Mbappe. You've got to be kidding me, man. Come on. Ah, we should have won it. Whatever. Let's take a look at our match objectives. Get a 9.0 rating. Get an assist. I mean, if it... If they're telling you to get a 9.0, you know the team you're playing aren't that good. And then get a team position of at least 65%. So, an assist and 9.0 should be enough. Let's go ahead and get this one going and see if we can add to our goal tallies here and, and um, try and clinch that top scorer spot. The first half is underway. It's bloody white balls on white pitch again. It's so bright I can't even see. Gotta get off the pitch. Fold in. Goes out wide to Gaia. Lovely play to Anton Rebic. Still with Rebic. Tries to find Foden. For tackling from Phil Foden. Cut it by Richarlison. Get in there. Foden again with a tackle this time. And this time he finds an assist for Richarlison. Who's going to be doing the damn chicken dance again. The last time Foden intercepted the ball in that range. He went ahead and scored. But this time unselfishly. He wins it back here. Good tackle. And referee says no foul. Lays it to Richarlison. Who needs some confidence to get back into the top form he was in at the start of the season. And he definitely needed that top in there. Lovely caught back. And it's a strike from Richarlison into the back of the net to put AC Milan up 1-0 in this game. Get in there, boys. Now it's Sauten. Finds Dominguez. Goes out wide to Orsolini. Can he get past Gaia? 
Go back to Bustos. Now it's Shorten. Lovely true pass to Soriano. Soriano, what a goal by Bologna to get right back into this game here. That true pass was excellent and Soriano puts Bologna leveled. What a strike. I don't know how he got past Simon Kia there, but good skills from him. Look at this true pass here. Lovely pass. Splits the defense. Does a little bit of skill. Cuts it back. Skips past Simon Kia. And this time, no goalkeeper is saving that into the roof of the net from Roberto Soriano. And it's 1 1. Milan have been shell shocked here. One added minute to this first half. It's now with Yadley. Finds Phil Foden. Richarlison is making a run for Foden. There it is. Oh. Oh, trial layoff there for for Anton Rebek to go in and have a goal, but it's blocked. Corner kick comes in. Terrible corner kick from Phil Foden. And there goes the first half whistle. 1-1 at the break here. And AC Milan have to be careful because these are the games that you could drop points in. And they have to make sure they don't drop points because they are leveled on points with Napoli in first. So they have to get a win in this game. So far, we have the assist already. Got to get at that 9.0 rating. I think we need another assist or a goal. And that should put us back to that 9.0 rating. Hopefully... Lazio at Tau, Venezia, Cagliari are winning. Roma are beating Inter Milan. What a shock. Inter Milan have been awful. Awful this season. It's going to get a second half going and see if we can turn this draw into a win here. Soriano, good play here so far from Bologna. It's with Sanson. Anatovic, good true pass. And it's a goal for Soriano again. Oh my goodness. The goal getting midfielder has two goals against AC Milan. We have been stunned here today. Oh my goodness, unbelievable performance from Bologna. They went down a goal and they've just turned up here. Look at this passing and movement. Look at this true pass from Marco Anatovic there. And it's an easy tap in for Sariano. It's 2-1. Milan has to wake up in this game. Now it's to Dominguez. Now it's shouting. Providence. Providence, I should say. Dominguez. Anatovic, lovely true pass. It's Soriano again. It's a hat trick for bloody Soriano. Soriano with a hat trick. <laughs> Who is this Soriano guy? Who is Soriano? Roberto Soriano is, is, is even that good. It's snowing here and he found a way to beat the league leaders. Soriano with a hat trick. He's outshown the Phil Foden. Richarlison, every single one of them. Lovely true pass from Anatovic again, who's been the provider in this game. And he has a hat trick. I don't even think Foden has a hat trick this season. Oh my goodness. And Milan are throwing everything they can now to try and rescue this game. It's 3-1 for Bologna. Do it's 10 minutes left to play. Okay, if we're going to rescue anything, a goal has to come now. Foden finds Rafael Liao. Good play from Liao. Foden gets in there. Get the ball back. What a call by Phil Foden. Eight minutes left to play. Can Milan tie this? They need a bit of magic. And Foden has producers to put them right back into this game. Look at this goal. What a beauty from Phil Foden. On the left for cut in. And look at this. We finally get the goal from outside the box. The curler, the finesse shot there from Phil Foden. We've been waiting for this all season. Look at the curler on this. Oh, into the back of the net. Pick that out. Pick that out the net, he says. Let's go. Come on. Shimone. What a goal by Phil Foden. Let's go. We're still, we're still a long ways away. Eight minutes to go. Can Milan tie this game? It's 3-2. Plays with Gaia. Two added minutes to this game. This has to be the last attack. It's Phil Foden. Phil Foden. There it is. Mitch Allison. Oh, my goodness. What a save. That was it. Oh, he's pulling out. They're pulling cramps here. That was the... Oh, it was from the tackle, actually. Anton Ribbit with the crushing tackle there on Orsolini. Corner kick. Just one minute left to play in the two minutes. Cross comes in from Liao. Oh, Giroud. Come on. Referee don't blow yet. Foden. Phil Foden! Oh, no. <laughs> we were looking for the glory there, man. We probably could have passed it. Probably could have passed it. But there goes the full-time whistle. It's a 3-2 loss for AC Milan. Unbelievable. Quite shocking if you think about it. I didn't expect I didn't expect this from, from Bologna. Like I said, I know how to pick the games. I did pick that one. I didn't expect it to be 3-2 to Bologna. Unbelievable. They deserve it. They deserve it. I mean, what, what what's his face? Soriano. Soriano, man. He absolutely brilliant. All the hard work from Phil Fallen outdone by Soriano. 
Ah, uh, it's one of those. It's one of those. Roma won. Did Napoli win? I'm pretty sure Napoli won. How do we play that fantastic and win? We score one of the best goals as well. Uh, and we have the cup match coming coming up against Sampdoria. Round of 16 in the Coppa Italia. So we'll be playing this round of 16 against um, Sampdoria. Then the last time we simmed this game, we, we won or we lost. I'm not even sure at this point. But we're going to play this last game here for this episode. Um, we need to get a win. We need to get a win. We're not well rested. Obviously, the games are coming thick and fast. But that's the Sampdoria team. Cagliera. Oh, my goodness. Nino, Damsgaard, Vera, Torsbar, Kandreva is in there as well. Murillo. I mean, that's not a bad team. That's not a bad team. Um, but look, we should be getting a win against Sampdoria at San Siro as well. So hopefully we can do this. And we are at the round of 16, <laughs> round of 16 of the Coppa Italia to take on Sampdoria at San Siro. Round of 16, we should be winning this game. We should definitely be winning Sampdoria. But I'm hoping for a good game. You, know, you never know. We just got stunned. Stunned by Bologna. So anything is possible. Let's take a look at match objectives here. Get a match rate of at least 8.5. Get a team possession rate of at least 60%. And get a conversion rate of at least 60%. What is that? What is all this crap, man? Who cares? We just got to win the match. We got to get into the next stages, and that's all that matters here. Let's go ahead and get this game going. The sec first half of the round of 16 is underway. Very. Nino finds Qualiarella. Lovely true pass from Qualiarella to Damsgaard. I said Cagliarella, didn't I? <laughs> oh, cuts it back. It's very. Go tackling. Get it out, mates. Get it. What What our defense playing now? Oh, good save. Good save there from Minion. Oh, Damsgaard. Still Dam's guard. Go tackle in there from Conti. One added minute to this first half. And there goes the first half whistle. A very tight and cagey game. Surprise, surprise from Milan here. Um, they haven't really created any sort of chances to they even think about being in the league. But look, we we have 45 minutes left to play. And we have to turn up in this game. We have to turn up. It's a club competition. He knows it as well. He knows he has to turn up here. Atalanta beating Empoli, Lazio winning, and Inter are tied with Hellas Verona. Inter Milan are pretty shy down there this season. Let's go and get the second half going, and hopefully we can win this game. You never know. It's all you have to be played for. Oh, Cagliarella. Cagliarella. Can he get past Bakayoko? It's Nino. Lovely true pass to Torxby. Or Torxby. Whatever you want to say. It's with Kandreva. Cuts it back to Torxby. What a goal. Oh, what a save. What a save by Mark Me. How many times does he keep us in the games? How many times Rebek makes way for Liao? We have to kind of, we gotta get a win some way. We gotta get a win. Even if it's a one goal win, I'll take it. I'll take a one year right now. Come on, boys. Goes out wide to Kandreva. It's a true pass to Nino. What a save by Mark Minion. Sam Dora should be up in this game, but at least one or two nil. But I tell you what, the defending, the goalkeeping has been excellent again. You shall not pass. How many times is he keeping Milan in this game? Get it out. Get it out. Oh, what was that? Oh, no. Foden loses it. Lovely true pass to Brokes. It's Brokes. We have to work back. We have to work our way back, boys. Oh, he's giving up. Is it a pen? <laughs> oh, it's a foul. It's a pen. He's giving a pen for Sampdoria. We could be out. Oh, Minier saves it. <laughs> oh, my goodness. What a goalkeeper. What a goalkeeper. Mark Minier gets in there. Cross comes in. Headed away. Wow, that goes the four-time whistle. It ends nil-nil here in 90 minutes. And Mark Minion is your savior. He has kept AC Milan into this game. Oh my goodness, Sam Duria deserved to be winning this game. I don't know how they're not winning this game. I, I have no clue, but they, they, they should be up. They should be up. Doesn't go to extra time. We go to extra time, ladies and gentlemen. More minutes for you guys here. I hope you enjoy this one. Simon Kier now makes way. Talk speed makes way as well. Who will win this match? The extra time first half is underway. Foden goes out wide. Oh, keep it. Jamie, Adley, what a save. Fardy. Oh. Oh, can he keep that in, Tomari? He can. Go play from Tomari. Foden wants it. Foden gets it. It's Phil Foden. Oh. Excellency from Phil Foden gets in there. The king 
of Milan Serie A champion. Look at this, man. This, I don't even know what to say. I am stunned. <laughs> what a goal by Phil Ford. I thought we've seen the best from him here, but no. This is the best from him. The team needed him. Look at this goal from Phil Ford. And oh my goodness. Take a bow. Take a bow, Phil Ford. And what a strike. <laughs> Look at the bend on that. Oh, he's going crazy. He couldn't believe it. He couldn't believe it. Phil Foden. We got to watch that back one more time. We got to watch that back one more time, ladies and gents. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, what, 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 where is it? There it is. Look, we got to look at the bend on this. Look at this from this angle. Phil Foden. Oh, the bend. The band goalkeeper is taking steps. He can't get to that. What a goal from Phil Foden. Get in there. Oh, this kid is he's, he's amazing. Future Ballon d'Or. He's absolutely spectacular. A world beater. Talented player. Everything he has. Generational talent. He's put AC Milan up here. 1-0 in the extra time. What a goal. One minute added on to this. What is the goalkeeper? I just realized the goalkeeper is having a ball. We didn't pressure him there. Ah. Uh, 15 minutes left to play. We've made a hard work of this one. 15 minutes left to play. What a goal from Phil Foden. Oh my goodness. <laughs> ah. we, if we don't win this game on that goal, I don't... But let, let's not forget the penalty save. The penalty save from Mike Minion. Everything. This game has everything. I'm loving it so far. Let's keep it going. Oh. Foden. He really wants this. Good play. Foden. Come on, Foden. He has no stamina left. He's tired. Still Phil Foden. Lovely pass. Come on. You got to finish it now. Got to finish it. What a save. Jamie Vardy. Game over. Game over. Game set match. AC Milan has done it. They are moving forward towards the semifinals of the Coppa Italia. They have to do it the hard way here, but they got it done. This goalkeeper. This goalkeeper is... He's excellent. He's spectacular. He's amazing. He's awesome. Lovely control there. Cuts it back on his favorite fold. Good save from the goalkeeper. And Jamie Vardy there with the top in. The header top in to, put, to make it 2-0 here for Milan. Oh, what a game. One added minute to this game. Oh, it could have went to penalties below. Fold and goal. Fold and goal, man. What a goal from Phil Fold. This is the best game ever. I've ever played in career mode for a long time. I I will look back at this and go. I remember exactly how fun that goal was. What a game! I mean, you have to go the distance. We should even be talking about this game. We should be out of this game. Mark Minion with this, the last save penalty there in the 90 minutes. Foden puts out the spectacular goal in the extra time. I mean, this game had everything. Oh, uh, Sam Doria, look, they're a damn good team. Proper team. They gave us a competition, Sampdoria. They should hold their heads up high. I'm definitely playing the game against Sampdoria. And we, I think we have them coming up next as well. So, they're a good team. We're definitely bringing that. Foden, 8.6 rating. McMinions with a stop. Look at this. It, I mean, this is incredible. He, he was all over. Look at this. He shouldn't be saving that. He saves it. He shouldn't be saving this one. He saves everything. He, you shall not pass. Look at this. This is a clear cut chance here. No, he saves it. <laughs> oh, look at this. Penalty save. This was a chance for them to win it. 90 minutes. No, he saves it. You shall not pass. And then Foden goes and pulls this out. He pulls the rabbit out the hat. Phil Foden, the magician. Look at this. Oh, <laughs> take a bow from this kid. What a game. What a game. What an episode. Look at the control. Just look at the camera angle from behind. Look at the dip, the whip. Oh, goalkeeper tried everything. He's going with his, his left hand, his right hand. He, he doesn't even know what to do. Foden there, that's a, that's one of the best games ever. Milan won, Lazio won, and Atalanta won. Pretty pretty easy there. Pretty easy this. Oh, Juventus is still yet to play. Napoli, Roma. So there's still good teams in this competition. Still good teams. So I'm I'm looking forward to the cup competition. But this is a massive massive win. We have some Doria coming up in the in the Serie A. So we'll save that for the next episode. But we're now second. Just a point below Napoli. 19 games played. Well, just halfway through the season. So it's, it's fine. But yeah, I'm going to play the games against Sampdoria. They gave me a good game in the cup match. So definitely play Sampdoria. Then we have Napoli coming up. And then the Champions League as well. So lots of games to look forward to. I'll go ahead and stop here for now. Thank you for watching again. I apologize if this is a longer episode. But I'll see you guys in the next time. Take care.